How the devil are you guys? It's me, Robbie Dot, and we're back with William in Dragon Age Origins. And we've saved the town. Hey, yeah, well, we're partially. Yeah, we've basically saved the women, children, and Thomas over there. And I think Dwin survived, the, the dwarf. Um, I think the barn. Did the barman survive? I don't know. Soon go find out. Not many people did survive, let's put it that way. So if I do save this town, I'm not going to have many people from it to help me. Now let's have a look. Tavern. Ah, militia. Okay, so some people did survive. Uh, Bella. I admit, for a while, I didn't think either of us would survive. It's good to see you did. Yay. It's good to see you too. Anything I can get you? Uh, I believe you. I believe you made a promise. Yes, you did. You mean about helping me leave? I, I wouldn't hold you to that. You've already done so much for us. Yeah. Okay, then I'll leave you to you. Anything work. I can get you? Uh, any supplies you've got? Fair enough. Let me see what Lloyd stored in the back. You can help yourself. Oh, you haven't restocked. Okay. Were you people? Were you three giving me uh, space for a reason? Did you think I was getting on with her? You were wrong. Just about. What the? When? What are you doing? Oh, wrong way. No way. So meet. Tegan up near the windmill, he said. So who's actually alive? Thomas and a couple of militiamen. And really? Really? Are we are we having it that my <laughs> Oh I didn't. Fine, I'll have them back then. It is begun. If you don't want them, I'll have them. <laughs> oh dear. Right. Oh, what we do have is a load of equipment. Right. Six studded. I got tier five. What about the gloves? Tier three to tier what? Yep. See. And boots. Tier three to tier two. The tier three to tier two. It's getting better all the time, you see. Nicely done. Now, what about uh, Liliana? What have you got on? We've got tier 2, have some tier 3. Tier 3, tier 3, oh, okay. But, yeah, yeah, have some of those to the match, right? What about tier 3 versus tier 2? Good. And what about your helmet? Tier 3 versus Tier 3. Studded helmet. Oh, it's the same one, right? You got two injuries. Alistair's got two injuries, right? Let's do Alistair, seeing as though he's the main man for you to get it. Oh. Uh, yeah, okay, fine. No, Liliana. Let's, uh, no, let's not do that. We might. Uh, not need to heal you yet. So militia. Should really go back to camp and then come back into town, shouldn't we? We're keeping watch should the monsters come again. I don't think they will, but we've no way to be sure. Hopefully we've dealt with the majority of them. Right, there's Tegan. What I do need to do, Knight Commander Harif. Oh, where were you? Tell you what I'm, I am going to do. I'm going to go and vlog. I'm going to go and sell nicely all this stuff I picked up. Ah, vlogging it. Poor, poor militiamen died in this stuff. But I, I know and I respect the fact that they died. But we also need the money. So, let's see what, was it Bella? Yeah, Bella. Let's vlog some to you. 
if you let me sell it to you. There she is. Anything I can get you? Yeah, supplies. Fair enough. Let me see what Lloyd stored in the back. You can help yourself. Let me see what you... Oh yeah, she's uh, letting me do it for free. Which is no good to me, I need money. Let's go to the, blah, 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 the blacksmith then. And then I'll... Ooh. Chances board. Never noticed that last time. Has that appeared? They've both appeared since I walked up the hill. Would you be in my grave as quick? Honestly? The end is upon us! The dead rise and foul magic spreads across the land! <laughs> Can I punch him? Let's say hello to Thomas, seeing as though he's like the only person capable of surviving. Hi, Thomas. So we won the battle? If this is what war is like, with so many people hurt and dying, I don't want to think about what fighting the Darkspawn will be like. Van Tegan or Al Eamon will be calling for volunteers hmm. soon, won't they? They'll need an army to fight in the south now. I'll go when they call me, I guess. I'm going to get drunk first, though, if you'll excuse me. There's a very nice barmaid up there who now probably owns a place. You never know. Try your luck. Horror awaits those who right. perish you. Repent your sins before death. Beg for the Maker's divine forgiveness. Shut up. Right. Calm down. I, I don't mean to. I, I just need to tell everyone. They need to know. They need to repent before... Before it's too late. I was too late for my wife. She died. So horribly. And she... She was not repented. I need... I need to help everyone. To prepare. Right, okay. Right. I'm sorry about your loss. If I can help you, I will. But you can't go shouting at everybody else. Help me? There is no help for me. I just miss my wife so much. This is all so horrible. I... I think I just need to sit down. I need to collect myself. Alright, we're actually past the speech check. Well, yeah. Wonders will never cease. Uh, yes. It shall be done. Blacksmith here. Where are you? Owen. Good to see you in one piece. Do you have news of Elena yet? Not yet. Well, I'll give it some time. Now's the best time to go into the castle, though, and see for yourself. Remember, a promise is a promise. I will. Let's talk business first. Right. I haven't got much, obviously, but I'll do whatever I can for you. Right, what have you got? Uh, don't know, what has he got? I need to log what I don't need. Tier 1, I'm going to need that. Uh, I don't need them either. Nice. Alright, tier 3 studded helmet. Let's just keep one of the good stuff for now. Until I've guaranteed got rid of everything else. Just, you know, make sure that when I go through my character, double check. I have not left anything that shouldn't be equipped equipped. Yeah. But this is a way of making a bit of money, isn't it? Should have come here more more often and sooner. Alright. That's on robes, do we need those really? I don't know. And what have you got? Right, we're good for now. Now we're down to 59 out of 90. While we're here, let's have a quick look at the chances board. 
caravan down. Oh, great. Just take it all. Unfortunately, unfortunate news has arrived that Dartspawn have extended to incursion into areas previously thought safe for travel. A runner from a border caravan brings word they are normally passed into infested territory and were being attacked tracked by several unseen creatures. He was dispatched to seek help and does not know the fate of his fellows or the viability of the trade route. Travellers in the area are urged to be cautious. Any with the ability to rescue or determine the status of the trouble group will be rewarded. Okay, brothers and sons. Communication. Blah blah. Loved ones. Yes, we will take all these side quests to go and help the people. Intended concepts. You can always read them again. He says. Is there anything I can turn in? Oh, grease the wheels, my friend. Blah blah. So, accept. Thank you. Make us blessings upon you, Warden. That's nice. Right. Hmm. Should I go talk to Dwin? Maybe. Just have a quick talk to Dwin before I talk to Van Tegan. I'm pretty sure Dwin survived. Don't know if he got his lock fixed. Just Phew, some fight. Reminds me why I left Orzammar in the first place. Yeah. So, why is that? Constant fighting. A warrior's life there is blood, ash, and dust. Though I'm not sure who's dirtier. These creatures are darkspawn. Ooh, good question. Yes, thanks for helping. Don't thank me. You paid me, fair and square. First thing I'm gonna do is get some sleep. For about a week. Go oh. celebrate or whatever it is you're gonna do. You won, right? You're mm. a hero. Or something. Suppose. Go celebrate, or whatever you have to do. Yeah. What do you intend to do now? Rebuild. Same thing I intended to do before. Except this time, there's more humans left alive to help. First <laughs> thing I'm gonna do is get some sleep. For about a week. Go celebrate, or whatever it is you're gonna do. Yeah, right. You won, right? You're a hero. Or something. Will you stop ending the conversation? Go celebrate or whatever you I'm have to do. i to ask you questions, right. Could you share help with the Darkspawn? If I wanted to fight Darkspawn, I'd have stayed in Orzammar. No thanks. Fine. Go celebrate or whatever it is yes, you're gonna do. Yes, yes, yes. I've not listened to that 14 million times. you still got nothing for me to steal, have you? Oh, I'm never gonna get my 100 silver back, am I? Fine. To Van Tegan. It is then. Uh... Right. So, guys, any interesting stories to argue about between you? No? Okay. I don't know. I feel. I feel like I should possibly change the uh, party up a little bit. Wind's got to stay because she's the only mage we got who heals, which means I always need an Alistair or I need a warrior. So that so it means it's either got to be Alistair or somebody else. And I'm a rogue, so Liliana's a rogue as well. So she's the obvious person who has to be swapped out. However. Could bring Sten in for Alistair. And Morrigan in as well, I suppose. But those two tend to. They, they tend to see the world in a rather nasty shade of grey, don't they? Yes, they're not quite as helpful. Odd how quiet the castle looks from here. You would think there was nobody inside at all. But I shouldn't delay things further. I had a plan to enter the castle after the village was secure. There is a secret passage here, in the mill, accessible only to my family. Uh, yeah, why didn't you mention this before? I knew you would choose to enter the castle instead of staying in the village. And we needed warriors. I'm sorry if I... Maker's breath. Okay. Tigan, 
Thank the Maker you yet live. Isolde, you're alive. How did you... What has happened? I do not have much time to explain. I slipped away from the castle as soon as I saw the battle was over, and I must return quickly. And I need you to return with me, Tiga. Alone. Uh... Yeah, we're gonna need more of an explanation than that. What? I... Who is this man, Tigan? You remember me, Lady Isolde, don't you? Alistair. Of all the... Why are you here? That's they are Grey Wardens, Isolde. I owe them my life. Pardon me, I... I would exchange pleasantries, but... Considering the circumstances... Please, Lady Assault, we had no idea anyone was even alive within the castle. We must have some answers. Yeah, what I he said. I know you need more of an explanation, but I, I... I don't know what is safe to tell. Tigan, there is a terrible evil within the castle. The dead waken and, and hunt the living. The maid responsible was caught, but still it continues. And I think Connor is going mad. We have survived, but he won't flee the castle. He has seen so much death. You must help mm. him, Tigan. You are his uncle. You could reason with him. I do not know what else to do. Okay. Right. What about Al Eman? Is he still alive? He is. He is being kept alive so far, thank the Maker. Kept alive? Kept alive by what? Something the mage unleashed. So far it allows Eamon, Connor, and myself to live. The others were not so fortunate. It killed so many and turned their bodies into walking nightmares. Mm. Once it was done with the castle, it struck the village. It wants us to live, but I do not know why. It allowed me to come for you, Tigan, because I begged, because I said Connor needed help. Uh, yes. Do you think this evil could be some kind of demon? I... I, I do not know. Oh, Maker's mercy. Could it truly be a demon? I, I can't let it hurt my Connor. You must come back with me, Tigan. Please. Right, okay, right. What about this mage? He is an infiltrator, I think. Uh, one of the castle staff. We discovered he was poisoning my husband. That is why Eamon fell ill. Eamon was poisoned? He claims an agent of Terran Loghain's hired him. He may be lying, however. I cannot say. Hmm. Why must Tegan go alone? For Connor's sake. I promised I would return quickly and only with Tegan. Tegan, I know you could order your men to follow me when I return to the castle. I beg you not to. For Connor's sake. Right. Why do we get a feeling you're not telling us everything? Yep. Definitely a concerned mother. That much is clear. But something else is going on here. I... I beg your pardon? That's a rather impertinent accusation. Not if it's true. An evil I cannot fathom holds my son and the husband hostage. Came for help. What more do you want from me? Tigan, hmm. I do not have much time. What if it thinks I'm betraying it? It could kill Connor. Please come back with me. Must I beg? Maybe. Right, enough. We need to decide what we're doing here. The king is dead, and we need my brother now more than ever. I will return to the castle with you, Isolde. <gasps> Thank the Maker. Bless you, Tegan. <gasps> Bless you. Uh, what good will that do? Hmm. Does seem like I have little choice in the matter, though. I have no illusions of dealing with this evil alone. You, on the other hand, have proven quite formidable. Isolde, can you excuse us for a moment? We must confer in private before I return to the castle with you. Please do not take too long. I will be by the bridge. Hmm. Something is definitely going on. Here's what I propose. I go in with Isolde, and you enter the castle using the secret passage. My signet ring unlocks the door. 
Perhaps I will distract whatever evil is inside and increase your chances of getting in unnoticed. What do you say? Uh... Yeah, what exactly would I do in there? I wish I knew. I don't know any more about this evil force than Isolde seems to. I don't think we can afford to strip any of the few defenders the village has left, just in case. Here is my signet ring. It will open the lock on the door in the mill. Whatever you do, Eamon is the priority here. If you have to, just get him out of there. Isolde, me, and anyone else, we are expendable. I'm gonna rescue everybody, but I'll do my best. You are a good man. The Maker smiled on me indeed when he sent you to Redcliffe. So we are just going to send him with that woman? It seems so dangerous. But I can delay no longer. Allow me to bid you farewell. And good luck. Hmm. Okay. That is what we're going to do next time. So, if you want to see how I solve the castle's problems, you'll have to come back. So, until next time, this is Robbie Don, Robbie Gone.